Even though Assetto Corsa is getting old, there's a younger, better looking version coming along. The graphical engine has severe limitations, nothing is stopping its development by a group of committed third party modders. Assetto Corsa is a good looking game out of the box, but it can be made to look better just by using a few mods. Some mods add graphical features to Assetto Corsa that weren't even present on the base game or even not considered to be possible, others give it a fresh lick of paint. Today I'll be pointing out a few interesting mods for Assetto Corsa that will elevate your graphical game for this title. There will be a mix and match of types such as post-processing filters, shaders requiring injectors and also new features. Of course, this graphical improvement will come at the expense of graphical power, so expect a hit in your graphical performance with slower computers suffering more. I'd also recommend Content Manager for Assetto Corsa that helps with the installation of some shader packs. If not, you will be required to use a shader injector called JSGME, which normally comes in the shader packs. Bear in mind that you might require a backup, as some of your Assetto Corsa files might be required to be overwritten. All the links will be in the description below, so prepare a race department account if you don't have one. Graphics wise there are two main areas, post processing filters and graphics mods. PP filters don't change much of the game, you may select the filter most appropriate to your taste. Graphics mods will use shader injectors and have a bigger toll on the system, with more effects coming along as well. Firstly for PP filters I can recommend Burns Real Life Weather. This mod has fully calibrated and color corrected filters with a 6500K color temperature. This allows for an overall feel closer to daylight while not being overly drained out of color. This mod is best used with the provider weather which will achieve a good balance between color fidelity and overall performance. On the same page, there's Natural Graphics mod, which attempts a closer to reality look, replicating what the eye see instead of a camera. Color correction is on the same page at 6500K. The main feature regarding this mod is that while it does use shader injectors for better enlightening, it removes some of the effects such as lens flares or chromatic aberrations that will drain the FPS. According to the developer, this should boost your performance by about 15 fps. At the moment, this is my go-to graphics mod in Assetto Corsa because of the way it looks versus performance, it's simply stunning. If you're looking for a graphical package with more cinematic or photographic effects, have a look at Wagnum's graphical mod. It's not over the top, it does maintain some of the effects that I've spoken about before, lens flare and chromatic aberrations, and it does also have a slightly warmer color balance at around 6300K. So this is perfect if you are looking for sunset pictures, if you're looking for taking some videos, and it also should be a good choice for the majority of people. Lastly, on this graphical package, there's GBWS Reshade with the Weather package. The objective of this full package is to bring more saturation into the colors, bringing more contrast to the sky and also some light to underexposed areas. This package is meant to be used with the full weather mod, which has two main components. One of them is sort of a dynamically generated weather that changes uh, the look of the environment based out of the temperature of the track and this is not compatible with multiplayer. Then there is also an upgrade to the default weather which will be compatible with multiplayer. All of these mods will change the base Assetto Corsa files and it should be stated that they can be mixed and matched, meaning if you enjoy the weather files of a specific mod but the color correction of another one, you may do that. Next up is where it starts to become really interesting with the new functionalities. One of them is X4Fab's dynamic lights. What this mod is able to do is go around one of the issues that Assetto Corsa has, which is only one light source being possible at any time, which will be the sun. With this mod, add lights work, therefore night racing is something that can happen. Still, this is a mod that is limited by Assetto Corsa's engine design, so it has a severe toll in your system in terms of FPS. As such, this mod is best used with just a few cars in the track, and to fully emulate the nighttime, you will require a nighttime package, which I can recommend either Realistic Night Weather PP 
or Assetto by night. Another thing missing in Assetto Corsa is weather. In this case, there's a mod called Wet Mod that adds wet shaders to a few stock Assetto Corsa tracks and also a few more things. Shader wise, it will get a bit of that reflection effect in the surface as well as a spray effect which hinders the visibility substantially. The grip levels are reworked to feel closer to what it is driving on the rain, though it must be stated that this once again is also limited by the Assetto Corsa's engine as slick tires work better than groove tires and how this works is kind of a workaround on the engine's limitations. Assetto Corsa doesn't emulate water over the tarmac, so the way it works is reduce the grip levels and also give it a dusty feel over the top of the tarmac. It's just a workaround, but it works quite well for what the limitations of Assetto Corsa are. Lastly, TK Smoke Mods. This is one of those mods I've been using for years and keep forgetting to talk about. It's a fairly simple mod that replaces the stock smoke generation into something closer to reality. There are three flavors, Drift and Rally, GT and F1, and also Snow. This will change the amount of smoke created, as well as the persistent and the color of it. Even though it seems that it's not universal in use because it states either for Rally or GT or Snow or Drift, it goes well even with other mentioned uses. For example, if you use the GT or F1 flavor, you can use it for Drift or Rally. It should also be stated that this will have an impact on FPS, so if you are in a situation where a lot of smoke might be generated, for example in the start of a race, this mod might create some slowdowns depending on the system. Anyways guys, these are some of my favorite graphical mods for Assetto Corsa, there are plenty more, please leave them on the comments below, uh, give me your opinions on them. If you liked the video, don't forget to press like, subscribe and share. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time.